UAV swarm systems possess immense potential in various aspects, such as collaborative exploration, target tracking, formation flight, and payload transportation. Efficient, accurate swarm state estimation serves as an important infrastructure of these high-level missions. Most existing works adopt motion capture or GNSS module or camera to perform state estimation. We extend these sensors' capability by using LIDAR as it possesses many advantages. We propose Swarm LIO2, a decentralized, robust, efficient LIDAR inertial odometry for UAV swarms. Swarm LIO2 include two key modules. The first module is initialization, which performs teammate detection, identification and global extrinsic calibration. The second module is state estimation, which fulfills ego state estimation, global extrinsic refinement, and mutual state estimation. The initialization module contains trajectory matching and factor graph optimization. The state estimation is based on the air state iterated Kalman filter framework, and a marginalization is proposed to improve computation efficiency. To validate Swarm LIO2, we conduct various simulation experiments in MARSIM Simulator. In the initialization test, for Swarm LIO2, we make UAV-1 to fly a figure 8 trajectory in other UAV's field of view. The newly proposed factor graph optimization helps to finish initialization rapidly. In contrast, the previous work Swarm LIO requires each UAV to fly a trajectory in turn. This will lead to long total flight distances and large energy consumption. Compared to our previous work, Swarm LIO2 needs much less distance and consumes much less energy to fulfill swarm initialization. In this test, five UAVs need to fly through a smooth corridor. For a single UAV, its LIDAR would degenerate due to insufficient structural constraints. But for a swarm, they can safely fly through the corridor cooperatively relying on mutual observation measurements. After initialization, the UAVs hover at the entrance where enough structural constraints exist. After that, UAV-2 flies through the corridor with mutual observations from teammates. Then UAV-2 hovers at the end to offer mutual observation measurements to other UAVs. With mutual observation from teammates, each UAV can perform robust state estimation and safely fly through the corridor one by one. As far as we know, there is no other LIO methods for UAV swarm, so we compare a method with single-agent LIO methods, and UAV-2 is selected as an example. It can be seen that other LIO methods all encounter degeneration and exist obvious odom drift. But for Swarm LIO2, by fusing mutual observation measurements the UAVs can perform robust state estimation and construct consistent point cloud map. In this test, five UAVs need to fly through a dense forest, where occlusion frequently occurs. After initialization, the five drones fly to the opposite side and assure collision-free flights. In such scenario, Swarm LIO2 can perform smooth and accurate mutual state estimation even there is frequent observation loss. Also, with online refined global extrinsic transformations, the maps constructed by different UAVs can be aligned by post-processing and obtain a consistent large map. We compare the module-specific time consumption of Swarm LIO2 in our previous work. It can be observed Swarm LIO2 consumes much less time due to the proposed marginalization operation. We also count the transmitting bandwidth usage of our method and Swarm LIO. The average bandwidth usages of both methods increase linearly as the swarm size grows, but still remain at a low level, which is almost negligible compared to the network bandwidth. In this test, UAEV-1 carries a Livox MID-360 LIDAR and UAEV-2 is equipped with the Livox Avia LIDAR. MID-360 has 360 degrees horizontal and 59 degrees vertical field of view. The field of view of Avia is around 70 degrees by 77 degrees, which may encounter degeneration when facing a smooth plane. For Swarm LIO2, UAV2 can perform robust state estimation even encountering LIDAR degeneration due to the mutual observation measurement from UAEV1. But for single agent LIO, fast LIO2, the state estimation fails due to LIDAR degeneration. In this experiment, five UAVs perform inter drone collision avoidance with the accurate mutual state estimation and global extrinsic provided by Swarm LIO2. 
The computation is all in real time, with only 6.7 for microseconds average computation time for one frame. The estimated trajectories align well with the actual flight trajectories, demonstrating accurate state estimation capability of Swarm LIO2. Even in dense forests where occlusion frequently occurs, Swarm LIO2 can perform robust, accurate ego state and mutual state estimation. Comparing the IRVIS view and bird's eye view, it can be seen that the estimated states of Swarm LIO2 are well matched with the true states. In this experiment, all UAVs need to detect and track a target collaboratively on a dim night. They need to maximize the target visibility, meanwhile avoiding the static and dynamic obstacles. In this process, Swarm LIO2 serves as an infrastructure for automatic teammate finding, identification, and mutual state estimation. Firstly, only UAE V1 and UAE V2 are in the swarm and form a straight line formation around the target. UAE V3 and UAE V4 are placed at different locations at the beginning where they can't detect the target due to occlusion. Here UAE V3 detects the target and starts to track it. Without realizing teammates UAE V1 and UAE V2 prior the initialization, UAE V3 tracks the target in solo mode, meanwhile avoiding other UAVs as they are dynamic obstacles. In the process of target tracking, UAE V3 flies a trajectory enabling Swarm LIO2 to initialize its extrinsic with the existing Swarm consisting of UAE V1 and UAE V2. This initialization takes place spontaneously without interfering the tracking task for both the existing Swarm and UAE V3. After the automatic initialization, UAE V3 joins the Swarm. The formation naturally changes into a triangle to maximize the target visibility. Similarly, UAV-4 detects the target and starts to track it in the solo mode, and avoids other UAVs. After the automatic initialization, UAE-V-4 joins the swarm successfully. The formation naturally changes into a square to maximize the target visibility. Here UAE-V-1 is killed intentionally to emulate that one agent encounters failure. Swarm LIO2 automatically detects the dropout of UAE V1. Thanks to the decentralized mechanism, Swarm LIO2 is robust to single point of failure. The tracking mission is not impacted, the formation automatically changes back to a triangle. We implemented an interesting application, Collaborative Payload Transportation. In this experiment, UAE V1's trajectory is priorly planned to ensure collision-free flight. The other two UAV's trajectories are obtained by transforming pre-planned trajectory into their respective global frames using the precise global extrinsic provided by Swarm LIO2. The states of self-UAV and teammate UAVs are estimated in real time. 